Hi everyone, Bonjour here. Hope you're having a great day and that all is well. Today we've got some basketball hot packs from eBay. Uh, but before we get into these, we do have our giveaway from the last video. But let's go ahead and go to that, see who won. We'll come back and get into these. Okay, we're ready for our giveaway from the last video. And that was for two out of the seven. We had the T. Higgins, the Kyler Murray, the Lamar Jackson, Chris Godwin, T.Y. Hilton, Ronald Jones, and the Judavian Clowney. So the winner picks two out of the seven. And of course, in order to enter, you had to leave a comment and let me know which two of these you wanted, as well as uh, what your rating of the packs was. So if you don't have that in your comments and we get to you, I'm going to have to pick again. All right, so we already have the address pulled up. Let's go ahead and get our comments. This time we had a total of 28 unique commenters, so thank you all so much for entering and for supporting the channel. Of course, be sure to hit that like button if you are enjoying the content. Uh, be sure that you are a subscriber and share the videos with someone who might enjoy them. I would definitely appreciate that support. Let's hit the start button and see who our winner is this time. Good luck to everybody. Our winner, Darren Murray. This is a nice video. My order would be one Jones, two Higgins. I would give it a six. All right, so Darren, you got in everything, so congratulations. Let's see, we got the Higgins and the Jones. All right, so nice uh, rookie dual memorabilia, Ronald Jones, and the T. Higgins Rookie Rush. These are yours. Congratulations. Uh, Darren, be sure to send me a DM on Instagram, or you can email me. That is down below in the description, uh, so I can get that contact info and get these out to you. Uh, again, thank you to everybody for watching, for entering, supporting the channel. Be sure to keep watching. We do have another giveaway coming up at the end of this video. So let's go there now and see what we got today. All right, welcome back. So again, today we have some basketball hot packs from eBay. Uh, now these were some that I purchased uh, fairly recently. Uh, this was uh, within the last month. I think it was at the beginning of January. Uh, they are sold out. I will leave a link to the seller uh, down in the description below though. Uh, just in case uh, he does any more repacks. Uh, so let's take a look at some of the details here. I thought these were really good. Uh, they looked really good. Uh, here's uh, the information from the listing. This is a repack. Luka Doncic, Rising Stars and Legends Hot Pack. So we got 10 cards per pack, and I got two packs. Uh, these were $35 a piece. Uh, so you're looking at about, uh, th you know, $3.50 a card, which is not too bad. Um, uh, the breakdown, uh, out of those 10 cards, you've got one card of a rising star. Now these are the rising stars. Uh, you got uh, Jason Tatum, Donovan Mitchell, Luca, Trey, Ja, Zion. So you're guaranteed uh, one of these cards, and this will be from the rookie year. So I thought that was pretty good. Uh, all six players are equally distributed. Uh, one out of six odds of getting a Luka on average. So, not too bad. So, next, uh, one card, at least, of Michael Jordan, Kobe, or LeBron. With an insert or a parallel. Um, packs can contain additional cards. Uh, then, one random, genuine, autographed card, or a random memorabilia card. So it could be, you know, game used uh, jersey, swatch, game used floor, uh, jersey autos, rookie, uh, veteran patch autos. And then one random mem card. And then six random cards, uh, stars, all-stars, rookie cards. Uh, so it could be a variety of things. You can see a, a list of the, the stuff that we could hit out of those. All right, so, um, you know, for the price... And what is potentially in there? I thought these were these looked pretty good. So I went ahead and uh, decided to pick up a couple of the packs. 
Now, um, these are the two packs. We did get some bonus cards, and this wasn't in the listing, so they threw these in. So definitely do appreciate that. Thank you very much. And let's open them up. Let's see, we got a Michael Jordan on the back. All right, so we've got the Michael Jordan scoring uh, out of Upper Deck, and I have, um, I have one or two of these. I love this card. It's just a, you know, a cool hologram card of Michael Jordan. Do like it. We'll stick that there. And then we got another one, another Michael Jordan, NBA Hoops Milestones. Very nice. And we got a Dwayne Wade. A Carmelo Anthony. Oh, a Shaq. Oh, nice Shaq NBA Hoops. All Star. And some old stuff there. 93. Yeah. That should be a rookie. Cool. And got an Anthony Hardaway, Top's Finest. Very nice looking card. Always like that shiny chrome. That's cool. I remember him from back in the day. And a Brandon Roy, about a Fleer Ultra, and a little Jersey Swatch, and that is a uh, game used. All right, nice. So, not bad at all. Bonus cards. All right, so, off to a good start with the bonus pack, so that's... That's a good way to get it going. So let's see if we can hit a Luca in here. All right, so we start out with pack number one. I do like the way that it is all packaged up in the uh, team bag and, and it's covered up and uh, that's, you know, that's a good, that's a good sign as far as the quality. All right. All right, so we will keep that paper there. And our first card, there's our Michael Jordan. All right, seven straight. All right. Oh, and it's a, okay, I see. It's a kind of a, a front and a back uh, scoring titles. Seven straight scoring titles. So Wilt Chamberlain and Michael Jordan. Cool card. All right, next card, a Chandler Parsons out of 2011-12 Limited, and check out that auto. Now, this is what happens with that, uh, that ink after a while, and that is an on-card auto, but that ink bleeds over time, and uh, it's kind of a neat effect, actually. Um, you know, pretty clear auto on the numbering looks good. Yeah, so that's pretty neat. I like that one. Let's scoop that out of the way. I need a place to put all of these. All right, our next card is Super Swatches Eddie Curry out of 0304 Upper Deck. That's uh, numbered. 107 out of 250. Very nice. Dual swatch there. And that is game used warm up. Cool. Let's get him right there and push that back a little bit. All right, next. We've got a Dwight Howard. All right, just a regular, not numbered or anything. Just a regular old Dwight Howard. And next, we've got a Joel Embiid. 
Contenders Draft Picks 2020 Prospect Ticket. Not a rookie or anything, so yeah. All right, we've got another Carmelo Anthony Star Quest. Pretty neat looking card. Hmm, okay, and this is uncommon on the back, so I'm not sure what that's about. That's uh, from uh, 0809 Upper Deck, so maybe, I don't know, maybe some kind of parallel or something. And, got a Damian Lillard, 1516 Hoops. Alright, and next up, got a Hot Tandems. That's uh, Chris Paul and David West when they were in the New Orleans Hornets. Back before all the, the moving around of franchises and players. Cool card. And we got a LeBron. This is Phenomenal Beginning. And this is, yeah, 2004. All right, so I think this is uh, the, I'm almost 100% certain, this is the only LeBron James rookie that I have. And uh, uh, Raw, it's, you know, it sells for a little bit, but uh, graded, well, graded, a, if it was a 10, that would be nice. I mean, I'd have to check it out a little bit more, but it looks pretty good. Very nice. That's a nice one. All right, we'll set that. Right in the back. And then we have one more. And that's going to be, ah, there we go, Donovan Mitchell. Rated rookie. All right, out of Donruss. With an old poop brown color. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, that's, okay. This is, this is, this is good. I am impressed with this first pack. All right, and uh, let's go to pack number two. All right, we start out with another Michael Jordan, and this is another front back. We got Dominique Wilkins on one side, and Michael Jordan on the other, 20,000 points. Out of, I said, 93 upper deck. Very nice. All right, let's see. I'm going to have to move the bonus cards out of the way. We'll put all the Michael Jordans over there. Next up, we've got... A, LeBron James, Carmelo Anthony, Rivals. All right, so uh, not bad, not bad at all. Very nice. And I'm kind of running out of room here. Let's see. Move the Michael Jordan over there. And put that there. Yeah. All right, next up. We've got a Roy Hibbert. That is a signature collection out of Upper Deck, a sticker auto. That's out of 2009-10 uh, Upper Deck. All right. Next, we've got a Dwight Howard scrapbook swatches. Nice little swatch of game used shorts I do like that they uh, they actually let you know what it comes from you know with the, usually with football cards it's just you know 
And, you know, if, if it's game used, it doesn't usually tell you what it is. Uh, but this is good. Game used shorts. Cool. All right, next one. Got a Magic Johnson Century Greats. Got a Threads, 12, 13. And Russell Westbrook, also out of 12, 13 Threads. Next, we've got Amari Stoudemire. 2004-2005 Hardcourt. Alright. And we've got an Akeem Olajuwon Letterman. It's out of 14-15 Upper Deck Letterman Basketball. Down to our last Two cards. Oh, nice. Tyler Hero, rookie, out of XR. And I do like my XR cards. They have some really good designs, some really great patches. But yeah, nice. This is a good looking card. Nice Tyler Hero, rookie. Very good. So we're going to put that down right here. And put the Tyler Hero in the back. All right. And so we've got one last card. And uh, let's see. We've got it's a Prism Draft Picks 2019. And oh, here we go. All right. John Morant. And that is got a little, uh, little sticky note on it um, on the sleeve. Uh, Purple Refractor, All-Americans, John Morant, Prism Draft Picks, Purple, all right, very nice, I, I am, I, I'm really impressed here now, yeah, we didn't hit the Luka, we did not hit the Luka, rookie, uh, but I am I'm impressed here. I'm kind of hoping that this seller will uh, will be putting some more of these together because this was this was good. Uh, I'm very happy here. Um, good overall quality, very nice cards, and then you know just kind of at first glance they look to be in really good shape. Uh, they're all sleeved. Um, the big ones are top loaded, so that's always a great sign. You know in the Last video, um, you know, there were some cards that weren't sleeved at all. And, uh, you know, so you look for things like that with the with the repacks. Uh, it's those kind of things that kind of let you know the overall quality of it. Now, uh, w one thing I did in the last video, I kind of did a rating uh, out of 10. Just, uh, you know, just to give it, a, I just gave it a number. Uh, but I started to think that, you know, since one of the things I wanted to do uh, this year is, you know, look at more repacks, uh, I kind of thought maybe come up with uh, a rating system that kind of give a, kind of be able to compare repacks from one to the other. So uh, what I did is, is I came up with uh, four categories, packaging, pricing, potential, and productivity. Now, you know, I may end up tweaking this a bit and, uh, you know, changing things up as we go along. But for now, thinking this is what I'm going to end up doing with uh, each of the repacks that I look at. And so for this one, uh, each of these four categories uh, on a 10 point scale, I want to give a rating in each of those four categories. All right. So for these, I'm going to put up on the screen uh, what I'm going to go with as far as ratings uh, for each category. So for packaging, I'm going to give these a 9.5 out of 10. Uh, again, these were well packaged in the team bags. They all taped up securely. Uh, 
you have all the cards were you know or were at least sleeved up uh the big ones were top loaded and the you could tell that the packs were put together in a specific order okay so both packs we had you know started out with the Michael Jordan and we worked our way through and finished up with the uh the the two big you know um big hits uh, that we were looking for and uh, so so i'm 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 going to go with a 9.5 out of 10 on the packaging uh, for the price i'm going to go with an 8 out of 10 now $3.50 per card is usually a little bit more than what i'm looking to pay um, you know, uh, with a repack, I try to look for something around $2 a card, and maybe in that neighborhood, but, uh, you know, for three fifty dollars a card, uh, and, you know, with looking at that and what we got and the potential that was there, uh, you know, I could, I can see, you know, three fifty dollars a card was, wasn't too bad. Um, so an 8 out of 10 on the pricing, uh, the potential, now the potential for these was definitely there and you could tell that from the listing uh, there were a lot of pictures uh, the listing was was well uh, laid out all of that information was there you saw earlier uh, you know i printed out that section and, and so everything was clearly laid out and you could see that there were some very nice cards in there uh, now the only question was uh, you know what were the sets that these were coming out of so uh, we didn't have that information, but, you know, we ended up having some some pretty good stuff. You had the, the rated rookie, the Donruss rated rookie, you had the Prism draft picks, the XR, uh, you know, so, it, you know, it wasn't all of the the highest uh, valued sets, but not too bad. Uh, so the potential, I'm going to go with a 9.5 out of 10 uh, on this one. Uh, I thought the potential was there. For some really good things and then the productivity now the productivity is you know did it produce you know were there some nice cards that came out of these uh, and i would say definitely there were some very nice cards that came out of these you know the donovan mitchell the jaw uh, the lebron uh, tyler hero uh, you got the the michael jordans uh, there, there were you know a lot of pretty good cards that came out of these so this was something that i was definitely happy uh, with you know the, getting these particular cards and being able to add these to the collection um, you know anytime that i can get some michael jordan cards uh, and these were bonus cards you know even though they're not the highest valued cards out there i always enjoy adding those so if we take all four of those categories and average them up come out with an 8.75 out of 10 for these repacks all right and then going forward when we look at other repacks we'll use the same rating system and see kind of how it plays out and see how it fits um you know if this system is, is something that's kind of good uh, if it works or if maybe it needs a little tweaking and uh, of course in the comments down below be sure to let me know what you think you know do you do you agree with that uh that assessment uh, was it was it a pretty solid uh, repack like I'm thinking it was uh, let me know what you think about that what you think about the rating system and if uh, there are any adjustments that you think need to be made definitely would like to listen to your thoughts and maybe work those in all right so for the giveaway we're going to go with one of these four cards we've got the Dwight Howard scrapbook swatches the Russell Westbrook threads Got the Roy Hibbert Signature Collection and the Eddie Curry Super Swatches numbered out of 250. So, for the giveaway, of course, be sure to let me know down in the comments which one of these four cards you would like if you were the winner. And also, be sure to let me know what you think about the rating system. Got to have that in there uh, for the giveaway to be valid. All right, so those results will be in the next video. And before we go, 
you know what to do. Hit that like button, comment, subscribe, share with friends, help the channel grow. Definitely would appreciate the support. Have a great rest of the day or night. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next video, and I'll see you then.